The recent El Nino was massive. Satellite images from NASA shows that it nearly mimics 1997's El Nino, the most destructive on record. According to NASA, the images show nearly identical, unusually high sea surface heights along the equator and east-central Pacific. It's the signature of a big and powerful El Nino. Higher than normal sea surface heights indicate that a thick layer of warm water is present. El Ninos are triggered when steady, westward-blowing trade winds in the Pacific weaken or even reverse direction. This creates a dramatic warming of the upper ocean in the east-central tropical Pacific. Clouds and storms follow the warm water, pumping heat and moisture high into the overlying atmosphere. These changes alter jet stream paths and affect storm tracks all over the world. The recent El Nino altered global weather patterns, but now has transitioned to a La Nina phase, bringing even more changes to weather around the world.